everybody, it's Kanisha, Miss Kanisha17, and today's video is going to be a what's in my bag, which is really highly requested. I was a little hesitant to do this because I do switch up my bag a lot, and it is going to be very, very messy. And second of all, I don't carry it a lot in my bag compared to some people who carry like their laptop or iPad, which I do not at all. So, um, but nevertheless, I'm going to do it anyway. And this bag I received for my birthday a couple months ago, and it is Audrey Hepburn printed bag, and it's got the pictures of her from her famous films such as Breakfast at Tiffany's and um, Roman Holiday, and I absolutely love Audrey Hepburn. It's a long handle one, which I like, and it's a shopper kind of tote style. So, um, it's pretty heavy. So, I'm just going to show you guys what's inside. So the first thing is kind of obvious, it's my phone, and my phone case is a stitch case, and his little ears pop out, and I have the white iPhone 4S. Also, a lot of people have been asking for a what's in my iPhone. Um, I would do it, but the only thing is, um, I don't have a lot of, like, apps on my phone, or a lot of stuff on my phone, so, um, I mean, but still, if you want to see it, let me know in the comments below if you'd like to see a what's on my iPhone, because I will do that for you guys. Next thing I have, um, I only got recently, and I should probably get a case for, are my reading glasses, because I tend to get um, blurred vision, or my eyes tend to strain a lot when I'm reading and stuff like that, or if I'm just looking at a computer or an iPad for a long time, so I've got these reading glasses, um, and it's kind of weird with them on, because obviously everything's very crystal clear now, but um, yeah, I just use those, and I like to carry them with me, I need to get a case for them though, and hopefully I'll get one soon. Next thing is kind of random, I think it's from a while ago, is a water bottle, um, because I love water and I always drink water. The next I have as an essential is tissues, I've always carried tissues, I, I've, even when I was really, really young, um, like from primary school I'd carry tissues, it's just essential, and especially during the winter time if you get a cold, or if you need to give it to a friend or something. Next I have a book, um, I picked up this habit when I started secondary school, like if you have a lot of free classes or free periods or if you finish work and there's nothing else for you to do, um, I just like to have a book with me, um, especially if you're like in the car or something like that, it's very handy to have and I'm reading the Pretty Little Liars book and so far I'm liking it. Um, my diary, I like to have a diary or a planner um, with me because it's very, I'm a very organised person so I like to plan out my day so I'm just going to show you guys, um, it's kind of like my list of, I make like a list of things to do the night before and then in the morning I look at it and figure out what I need to do and I don't know, it's just really very handy, I prefer it much more to having the calendar on your phone because at least you can just like see it clearly and you've written it down so you remember it better um, but yeah this is just an ordinary pink one and it says 2014 to 2015 one so it's kind of like a school agenda. Uh, next thing I have is kind of random, it's a bottle of perfume. Um, I got this from Next in England, um, I think it's called Just Pink or something like that, I'm not too sure, but it smells exactly like Katie Price's Stunning Perfume, which is my favourite perfume. Unfortunately, I ran out and the bottle broke, um, so I got this one, which is a perfect, perfect dupe for it, and I like to uh, smell nice. It just smells very, very fresh and sweet and girly, it's my favourite scent. What I have is this coin purse, because I like to distribute my coins from my cash and cards and stuff like that in my purse. So this is a cute little purse I got from Primark. You might have seen it in my haul a couple months ago. And I just basically have coins in there. Um, it can get pretty heavy though, which isn't very fun. Next thing I have is my wallet, which you might have seen in my last What's In My Bag, which I did like well over a year ago. And it's LYDC London and it's got cupcakes all over it and it's pink. So I'm just going to zip this open and just show you a little glimpse. Um, I have cash in here. No coins, well, apart from this one lonely penny. <laughs> and then I have uh, lots of like IDs, a bus card. Oh, I have a H&M gift card, which I need to use up. I have like two bus cards. I don't know why I have two bus cards. One's run out. When I went to Chinatown with my friends in London and Piccadilly, um, I went to this like, we went to this Chinese shop and it was called the Kawaii Collective and we got like really cute onesies and like they have loads of cute Japanese um, kawaii stuff. It's really cute. Like any other person's wallet, I have a bunch of receipts. Oh, it's from Disneyland Paris when I went. I bought like a little Christmas decoration for my family. But yeah, that's all that's in my wallet. I don't carry a lot. Um, There's going to be a lot of random stuff, I'm warning you guys. I have a little purse, which is Hello Kitty. I think I got it on eBay or something like that. And in here, I keep my headphones because I'm always losing my headphones and I don't want them like just at the bottom of my bag because one time I left them at the bottom of my school bag and my school books actually crushed the little earpiece so I was very very scared since and these are really good quality head earphones as well um, they're by the brand No Fear but they have like the cushioned ear um, 
what do you call them, like earplugs, and you can adjust the volume just from the little tab um, around your neck. So yeah, I think these are good quality and I wanted to protect them. Next thing I've got is this cute little purse that I can't remember where I got it from. I think it was some shop in England and it's got cute like little muffins and it says like strawberry, blueberry surprise, chocolate, white chocolate chip muffin because um, I love muffins as well as cupcakes and it's just got my feminine stuff in there if you know what I mean. Uh, next thing I've got is Benefit Their Real Mascara. I don't know why I have this because I rarely wear this. Um, I think because it's just travel and compact it's easy just to throw in my bag especially if I need to top it off but um, yeah, it's just a, I think it's just a sample size, but there's a lot in there. When you get sample stuff, sample size stuff of Benefit, they usually have quite a lot of product in them, so they're quite worth it. Next, I have got a hair tie, just because, you know, sometimes you need to tie your hair up. Uh, then I've also got an EOS lip balm. These are always flying around and switching between my all my bags and purses. Um, this is the Strawberry Sorbet one, and it is so, so good. It's not my favourite one, um, I prefer the mint one, but I just carry this anyway because it's, you know, you've got to moisturise your lips when they're chapped. Next thing I carry in my bag is an essential for me, no matter what bag I carry, and I've been carrying it for years, and it is hand sanitizer. I am a big germaphobe, and especially if you're at school before you're eating lunch, I always, always sanitise my hands, because you never know of all the germs that fly around, and also during the winter time when coughs and flus and colds are going around, um, I like to have hand sanitizer. And this is the Soap and Glory Handmade, and it smells very sweet and like grapefruit so I like that one. Oh my gosh you guys are gonna think I'm crazy because I also have a second hand sanitizer yeah I'm that obsessive um this is a bath and body works one that my parents got me when they went to America and it has it's meant to be like a holder so like you clip onto like your bag or backpack or whatever or keys even and it's got like a little cat and then also you just clip in your sanitizer and this one is sweet pea which smells very very fresh and light and I really like it. So the next thing I'm going to pull out my bag is my EOS hand cream. Um, I actually I'm scared to use this up because I love it so much because the scent is cherry blossom and that is probably one of my favourite scents ever, Japanese cherry blossom. But um, the EOS hand cream is just as moisturising as the lip balm. Yeah, so, and I also like how slim it is because it can fit into any bag or any nook and cranny in a bag. So. Um, yeah, and it just smells very, very nice. Next thing I have is some lip stuff. I have this Primark lip gloss, which actually is very, very good. It's very, very light um, and sheer, but it's very, very pretty and looks very flattering. And I always, um, I think I mentioned this before, I like to pair it with my Rose lip liner from NYX. NYX has the best lip liners. As you know, I did a review um, a couple years ago. So um, yeah, very, very good combination. Next thing I have, because I like to smell good, um, is my Soap and Glory Glamalot Soft and Sexy Fragrant Body Spray. Um, I think I got this for Christmas last year and it just smells very, very um, sultry and spicy but also very, very sweet and I absolutely love this because it's travel size again so it fits into your bag, it's not too heavy. Next thing I have is two pens because you never know when you're going to need a pen and also since I carry my diary around I like to write down stuff so I have this Harrods one. Um, that I got last Christmas as well, which is a very, very nice pen. And then this is just cheap hotel pen, which I have, which I don't know why I have. So you're going to think I'm such a pig. Um, I have a dairy milk chocolate bar and a Snickers bar. The reason I have these is because with my hypothyroidism, and I'm anemic as well, if you didn't know, um, so basically I have the tendency to faint, or I have a tendency to have very, very low blood sugar, and I feel very dizzy and shaky and I need something to perk me up really quickly so I always carry like a snack, um, something sugary, I'm not diabetic by the way um, but I do have to carry something like this with me all the time because I've, in the past I felt very shaky or weak or nearly fainted and I didn't have anything. Next thing I have along with the sweets and sugar, um, this is just because I like them and I'm obsessed with them, um, strawberry mixed tic tacs, they are the best, I love them and also they kind of like perk up your breath throughout the day and also they're pink because pink's my favourite colour. Essence Long Lasting Lipstick 07 Natural Beauty, an MUA lipstick in shade 4 which is just a baby pink lipstick, Sugar Lips Lip Balm which is a bright pink which I actually like. Let's just count how many lip products I actually carry in my bag. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I probably never use any of these. I put lipstick before I go out. I don't see why I feel the need to carry all these lip products. I think it's just like in case of an emergency but I mean 
kind of but apart from that that is all that's what's in my bag I know it's not a lot compared to most people um, but it's just what I need and what I like to carry around with me and sense of security and I also love this bag but thank you guys so much for watching um, be sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram and Pinterest and Tumblr um, I'll have all those links down below if you like this video give it a thumbs up um, leave down comments down below of any other video ideas you like me to do and be sure to subscribe see you in my next video bye